Okay, so this is a bit of a throwaway video. I'm really only making this because it's, I mean, I was one of the first people to have seen it on Twitter. Like, I literally looked on Twitter. I'm like, is this thing even like, is anyone talking about this? But essentially, Linus Tech Tips had his entire channel, like, hacked. Like, right now, if you go on it, all you can see is streams of a fake Elon Musk and some other people essentially shilling crypto. Now, this is something that's been happening a lot on YouTube for the last, like, I don't know how many years at this point, but I don't think I've ever seen a channel with 15 million subs and like direct line of contact to some of the higher ups at YouTube. I mean, back in the day, I know Linus Tech Tips specifically has had conversations with uh, Susan Wojcicki. Now, I know Susan recently departed from YouTube to focus on her own life, but I don't know. I, I think it's pretty strange that such a large channel, somebody that is, you know, very well respected, mainly because they make pretty family friendly content, it's tech review shit, and somebody who's, again, like I said, had a direct line of contact, somebody who's provided feedback to the higher ups at YouTube. I think it's crazy that somebody that well known, and, and, and not just somebody, it's an entire company. I mean, Linus Tech Tips is a corporation with, like, I don't know, I don't want to say hundreds, but I, I think, like, over 60 employees, maybe more. I'm not sure, but I know it's a lot of employees and they do a lot of stuff. Like they're very, like they have many channels and this is a real company. This isn't like, you know, I don't know. I don't know who to compare this to. It's really shocking to see somebody or, or, or a channel like this get essentially fucking nuked. It's, it's insane. Um, but yeah, again, I, I don't really know what else to add to this, uh, video. I, I really just wanted to point it out, um, to anyone who is seeing it. I, I'm sure people are like asking themselves, like, what am I looking at now? Another thing that I noticed with this channel, um, they seem to have taken down like all of the recent videos and all that's up really is stuff from seven years ago. Now I really wonder, did they delete it all or did they like unlist it? Like what happened? Because if they deleted all of that content, I have two questions. A, what is YouTube going to do? Like, is YouTube going to fix that? Is YouTube going to do anything that could, you know, bring that content back? Or is that content really gone forever? Because that's something that, you know, when you see on the YouTube studio, it always says, if you delete this, it's gone forever. And I mean, I, I wonder, like, is that actually the case for, you know, somebody who's had their channel hacked? Um, I assume there's got to be like, fucking corpse versions of the videos in like the back end like i'm sure they don't delete them immediately it's probably like i don't know a 30 day hold or some shit but that just i don't know conjecture i'm just guessing and, and and to be honest like i said it's it's pretty unprecedented to see a channel of that size get hacked especially a channel that's currently active i mean sure if you had a channel with like 10 million subs that like hasn't uploaded in five to you know, five or 10 years, I could see some security problems happening with that. And if anything, what it tells us is be fucking careful. Cause like, and this can happen to anyone. And to be honest, it's kind of inspiring me to, um, right before I upload this video, change all my passwords and make sure that they're protected because golly, that is terrifying. I do not want to be somebody who has to deal with that, especially being a smaller content creator. I don't think that I'm going to get very much help. Um, but Again, I, I don't imagine this is going to be a long-term problem for Linus. Like, I'm pretty sure that they'll be able to get this solved pretty quickly. Again, he's a big YouTuber, so I'm not not too worried about him. But again, I think this is like a wake-up call for YouTube. Like, again, ultimately, I understand that it, a lot of the security falls on the part of the... Um, you know, person, the owner of the channel, ultimately were the people who should be protecting our channels. But at the same time, um, I, I find it hard to believe that Linus was not keeping his channel safe. I find it hard to believe he didn't have two factor authentication. I find it hard to believe that he didn't have, uh, you know, fucking really complex passwords and shit. Like I, d I doubt that a tech YouTuber, the size of Linus tech tips had poor security on their YouTube channel. That's all I'm going to say. I think that's pretty, I think that's a pretty fucking fair take. And to be honest, um, I think at this point YouTube needs to wake up and offer new, you know, tools and, and forms of protection for, um, YouTubers because th this is, I'm just going to be real. It's pretty fucking unacceptable that like anyone, anyone of any size on this platform can have their entire channel fucking nuked, bro. Fucking nuked. I mean, that's what happened to his channel. Right now, 
the people that are hosting these crypto scams, they can make fucking so much money right now. Not only are they making money probably, but if they chose, if they so chose, they could just go and delete the channel and it's gone. It's gone. Now, I don't know if YouTube, I assume YouTube could bring it back, but that's besides the point. The fact that that's even an, an option, a possibility that somebody can break in and take your shit, it's really fucked up. And, and moreover, like, again, he's going to get help. If that happens to like, I don't know, if that happens to Ween, if that happened to me, if that happened to Buster Live or a Cheeto or some fucking, you know what I mean? Like, if that happened to any content creator that's under like 500k, like, are we going to hear about it? You know what I mean? Like, is, is that, is it, are we going to, how much of a ruckus do we have to make in order for the, for our channels to get, you know, reinstated? So again, I'm not going to edit this video. This is kind of just a rambly, like, you know, thought piece video, whatever the fuck talking about something that's like literally happening right now. But, um, yeah, there's, there's, that, that's about it. It's, it, I feel like I'm fucking Mudahar with this type of video. This is like, some, you're going to see Mudahar make a video on this. I guarantee you some ordinary gamers are going to make a video on this. It's going to get, fu he's going to juice views. Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, leave a like, comment, subscribe. I am back. I took about a week off. I know I'm a bitch, but it's okay. I'm back.